Hello everyone welcome from the PPT guy. Today we learn how to create icons out of logos. We have selected file logos and we'll start with the Slack logo. It will be better if we have a background image. I have already inserted the logo images. So, first, start by inserting a shape and select a curved rectangle. Place the rectangle on the image. Adjust the curve of the rectangle to match the background image. Duplicate and place it on similar parts of the logo. Insert another messenger shape. Duplicate and place it on the image. Now, select all the shapes and click on Shape Format and then on Union. Now, we have an icon that can be changed to any color we want. Next, we'll create a YouTube icon. It is pretty simple. Insert a curved rectangle and adjust its curve. Send it backwards and insert a triangle. Adjust the triangle to match the play symbol on the YouTube logo. Select both shapes and click on subtract. Now we have a YouTube icon. The next one is the Microsoft logo, which is all squares. And it is very easy to create. Insert a square using a hard rectangle shape. Duplicate it and place it on all four squares. Select all the shapes and click on Shape Format and then on Union. Now, we have the Microsoft icon. Next, we'll recreate the Instagram icon from its logo. From the shapes insert a curved rectangle. First, insert the inner rectangle and adjust the curves. Duplicate it and adjust it to match the outer rectangles. Next, insert a hollow circle shape to match the inner circle and adjust the inner diameter. Insert a circle and select all the shapes. Go to Shape Format and click on Union. We have the Instagram icon. Next, we'll recreate the dribble icon. It is a bit complex, but we'll ease it out. Insert a hollow circle on the outer circle of the logo that is a basketball. Duplicate the same circle and place it to match one stripe of the logo. Select both shapes and click on the fragment in Merge Shapes.
repeat the same steps for the other two stripes in the logo. At last, select all the fragments and click on Union. We have a dribble icon. Now let's do something extra. Start by duplicating every slide. On odd slides, take the icons behind the logo and make them no fill. So, the icons will become invisible. Repeat the same for all 5 odd slides. Select all of the slides and add more transition. Now, let's see the presentation. The majority of the logos can be made into icons in PowerPoint. Follow the PPT guide for more PowerPoint tutorials and design inspirations.